I was trying to log into the web interface of one of my UPSs and I experienced the maximum number of web connections has been reached. No matter how many times I refreshed the website, I kept getting this. So the way I fixed it was I used PuTTY to Telnet into the actual UPS device. And make sure you switch it to Telnet. The default in PuTTY is SSH, but switch it to Telnet. And honestly, I was amazed that this actually worked. So I used my, law, my username and password to get in. And then at the prompt, I typed session. And when I typed in session, it showed that there was all these sessions open. And so then I, would, I went through and I closed out every single session one by one. And after that, I was able to log in. The way I closed out of the sessions was I typed in session minus D space five. Where I got the five from was the ID column in the previous screenshot. It said ID. And so I closed out five, six, seven, eight, nine. Actually, there was no nine. I closed out 10, 11, and 12. I closed all the ones that showed up when I typed in session. And I would just close by typing session, minus D, and then the number of the ID. Once those were all cleared, I didn't clear out the Telnet session, obviously, because I was connected with that. But once I did, removed all those, I typed in exit, and then I was able to launch the web browser interface successfully and log in with my credentials, and everything worked as intended. I hope this worked out for you. There are some other scenarios with different firmware versions. So put that in the comments below. If this worked, let people know because anybody on this video is looking for help. And uh, whatever your other experience was, just let us know. Thanks for watching TechNuva. See you next time.